This breed is the shortest breed of all native Indian dog breeds. Hi friends, welcome to Joe J. Pet. And today I'm going to tell all about the Kate Kol dog breed. It is another native dog breed and if you have your favorite Indian dog breed, please let me know in the comments down below. These dog breeds are found around the regions of Nagapattinam, Karekal and Tiruvarur districts of Tamil Nadu, India. Size and Description The Katai Nile is a medium-sized dog with short legs, similar to the Basset Hound. It is a small game hunter, a good watchdog and guard dog. The Katai Nile has a short coat. Coat colors come in cream, fawn, brown, black and reddish. The almond eyes are yellow. The ears are mostly erect. The breed should has a, have a scissor bite. The height of a male katekal is 12 to 15 inches, 30 to 38 centimeters, whereas the height of a female katekal is 10 to 13 inches, 25 to 33 centimeters. The weight of a male katekal dog is 33 pounds, 15 kilograms and the weight of a female cutty cow is 26 pounds 12 kilograms lifespan the average life expectancy of the cutty night dog is around 12 to 15 years but there has been cases noted where the breed has lived more than 20 years intelligence this dog is an aggressive dog, obedient, friendly, trainable, and compact. These dogs are lovable by children. They are super intelligent with a loud barking sound. They have a nervous temperament and like most dogs, they will become ferocious when they are harshly treated. It is a very brave dog to face bigger dogs and can easily attack them harshly by using its low height advantage. It directly bites the throat portion of big dogs easily. Early socialization with young children and other animals is recommended. Train ability. It is a successful sheep hound and scent hound. They have strong and sturdy legs and can jump over a fence when properly trained. They have a natural guarding instinct and are very active. Positive reinforcement training helps them to learn quickly. This also increases the bond between the dog and its owner. Friendly towards family. They make great family dogs and are good with children who they love to play with. They can become friendly easily only if they allow the person to come closer to them. Regular and early socialization is necessary if they are to get along with a family. Friendly towards strangers and other pets. While they are very affectionate to people they know, they are very aloof around strangers. They are aggressive like the combe and will try to bite rather than bark. They have some issues with pets they are not familiar with and can fight with other dogs over territory. Apartment living. The Katena will do okay in apartments and can live with only a small yard. So long as it gets enough exercise, they will do well on farms. The Katena should have regular opportunities to run free on open ground as well as on long brisk walks every day. Preferably at the same time every day. Novice owners, however, they are an intelligent breed and take to training well. They are adaptable to all types of climates and weather. So these dogs can also be grown in small houses and maintenance is easy. With that said, they do not need professional training and is best suited for novice owners. Overall, the Katenai is a short breed from India. It is very rare and on the verge of extinction. Still it is found 
in small areas of Tanjavur and nearby places in the Tamil Nadu state of India. Some are trying to save the breed by educating people on the dog's ability to be a good watchdog and companion. The, this rare breed's origin is not clearly known, but it is said that it is a very old breed. There are sculptures in Tanjavur temple depicting the same size dogs. Those sculptures are hundreds of years old. Like many of the native breeds of India, they are in real danger of going extinct. If you are really enjoying this, then hit the like button, smash that subscribe button, share it with your friends and don't forget to tell me your favorite dog breed in the comments down below. Thank you. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.